This video is meant for the educational purpose. Please ensure you understand the step before using any script. The goal is to help you to learn how to complete the lab effectively while following the Quick Lab Turns and Services and YouTube Community Guidelines. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. In this video, I am going to guide you through the process to complete this lab and help you to understand each step. First, log in with your Quick Lab credentials and once done with that, in the description box of this video, I have shared the GitHub link which will help you to automate some task over here. However, I will recommend you to follow along and understand what each command does so you can learn the process effectively. I will encourage to open and review the script to understand each step. So first of all, just me scroll down over here and from here just me open this link in incognito window over here. This will activate your cloud shell. So just me wait for that. And it's finally done. Now just me come back over here and from here you can see this call command. This will download this GitHub repo from my GitHub to your cloud shell. So just me copy this, come back, paste hit enter ok now we have to make this file executable for that we have to just me run this chmod command so just me copy that come back over here paste hit enter ok now we have to just me run this file for that just me copy this command come back paste hit enter ok once you run this command you can see it's asking for the bucket name for that just me come back to the lab instructions and click on the task number one and from here you can see this bucket name so just me copy this make sure that you do not copy any extra space otherwise you will face an error so just me copy like this come back paste hit enter okay now for the region just me copy this region over here just me come back paste hit enter okay now for the topic name just me scroll down and from the task number two you can see topic name copy this come back paste hit enter now for the function name just me come to the task number three and from here you can see this is the function name so just me copy this paste hit enter wait for a second and then just me click on authorize now you have to just me wait for this command get execute and once it's done you are done with this lab so just me wait for a couple of minutes and after that we will check the score for the lab once you run this script, it will automate many of your steps to require to complete the lab. But it's essential to understand the process behind those steps. The goal is to use this script as a learning tool to help you to complete the lab, not just get a score. After the script run, you can go to the lab page and click on the check my progress to see the score. Make sure to review what each task does and why it's important in the lab so that you are not just getting a score but actually learning the concept. Now just simply wait and watch the command execution and understand what each command is doing.
and is finally done. Now if you just make come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for each and every task, you will get a score without any issue. And if the score is not updated for any particular task, no need to worry. Wait for a couple of minutes and you will get a full score on this lab without any issue. So just wait and watch. And as you can see, it's done. As I said, lab take time to update a score. So don't worry about that. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. If you still have any doubts, please do let me in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day, guys. Remember, this video is for educational purpose. Please make sure you understand the step and follow the quick lab terms and services and YouTube community guidelines.